The game of Hundo started out as the back-to-back -back 100. Completing 100 mile race one weekend, and then completing a subsequent one on the following weekend. And eventually I made it to five and thought, can I get to 10? And it was, <laughs> it was just as crazy as it sounds. I spent a year and a half of my life getting to week 68. Of all the reasons to end the game of Hundos, a global pandemic is a very good one. But I couldn't accept that. I want to run this for David. I was always a shy kid growing up. Um, my brother was the total opposite. <laughs> I would tell David, you gotta say more, man. Like you can't you can't just travel. And then he would tell me the, the opposite thing, right? He's like, no. You're like, Michael, you work too much. Like 60 to 70 to 80 hours a week and not doing anything, like that's not how you're supposed to live your life. I, I looked up to him for that because I didn't have that confidence that he had to just like go and be. These things that David kept telling me, <laughs> like live your life because you don't know, right? He's a prime example of that. I started taking steps after that to be more outgoing. I couldn't believe how long it took to run 10 miles around my living room. And I thought, I, how on earth am I gonna make it to 100? This was, this was mind numbing already. And the thing is, you have all the comforts of home all around you. You can stop at any time. Having a live stream, having people watch and say, you know, wow, you can do this, keep going. I don't know if I could have continued if I didn't have that accountability. I aim to mix it up, certainly to keep myself engaged, but to keep viewers engaged. I decided to climb the cumulative uh, ascent of Mount Everest, which is 29,029 feet. And the weekend after that, I descended to the depths of the Mariana Trench, which is 36,201 feet. Treadmills don't go downhill, so you have to modify them so that they, they're angled down. And I ran 100 miles on my rooftop. The weekend after that, I ran 100 miles around my block. It was a success. I would tell David, that I'm not that person from back then. He was right. 